Hi there, I'm Belgia, and this is Let's Play Red Dead Redemption. We've just hopped off the boat from the States, and we're headed to the very friendly village of Chuparosa. Hey, gringo! Hablas español? No, sir. Pardon, pero yo habla un solo poquito español. <laughs> habla English? <laughs> oh, sí, gringo. Hablo mucho inglés. Sí. Hablo filthy fucking bean eater. Hablo Slippery little Mexican, oh. no, little piece of shit. Shit. <laughs> Comprende, amigo? Comprende? <laughs> hey, what are you doing here, gringo? I don't remember inviting you to my country. I don't think you did, amigo. I mean you no harm. <laughs> <laughs> you mean us no harm? This is funny. <laughs> what harm? could you do to us, exactly? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing, amigo. Now, I appreciate the welcome committee, but I'd hate to spoil a beautiful afternoon on such beautiful land with any further unpleasantries. Now, if you'll excuse me. Uh, holy, Ringo, I think you're forgetting something. A little taxation. <laughs> <laughs> I have a large family. <laughs> <Pretty> big. <laughs> I, too, have a family friend. So that we may see our families again, I suggest we part ways amicably. <laughs> can I see the boots, gringo? I think you can see them from where you're standing just fine, senor. Take off the boots, americano. As you wish. Oh, very good. Very good indeed, sir. What a great way to improve border relations. An illiterate farmer crossing the river coming into their civilization and butchering the local peasants? <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Don't mention it, old man. You kill peasants, you become a peasant. I never aspired to be anything more. <laughs> a socialist, huh? No wonder you left America. Not many things, most of them bad. But a man of political principles? No. Well, then I fear Mexico may not be for you, sir. Don't you worry about me. Oh, but I do worry. An angry man a long way from home, a man who handles a gun as sloppy as you. I can handle a gun okay, partner. Yeah, as long as you're killing quail or peasants. But if you have to face another man, you don't stand a chance. And you do? I can show you a few tricks. Come with me. Hold on. What's your name? <laughs> that doesn't matter anymore. And you? I never had a name, mister. I was raised in an orphanage. <laughs> a real American, huh? Wonderful. Just wonderful. Well, you won't make it in the circus, but you can shoot. Keep on practicing. Thank you, old man. Now, who are you? No one interesting. Who are you? <laughs> Landon Ricketts. Not a name that means much anymore. It means a little. You were famous when I was a boy. Yeah, killing men's a strange kind of fame. I was the fastest in my time. I must have been. I'm the only one left. What are you doing here? 
Living quietly. Waiting. For what? I don't know. And you? I'm looking for a couple of men. Bill Williamson, Javier Escuela. <sighs> Escuela's from here. It could be. This whole place is teeming with a, with Americans on the run. Mercenaries, locals hell-bent on revolution. Revolution? Another one? Yeah. Never really is. This whole place has been a hotbed for revolution since before the Spanish left. Now there's another local guy running around promising the peasants their freedom. Ah, just like the last two or three. Local government? Foul bunch. Colonel Allende, he runs this place like a feudal king. He's an awful individual. Is that so? Yeah. Until someone puts a bullet in his head. Come well, on, let's get back to it. You gotta keep that back straight. Otherwise, it makes the gun jump. See if this Schofield makes a difference. Now, that's a real gun. Well, here we are in Chuparosa. And we've met probably the best guy in the game, Landon Ricketts. He's also upgraded our Deadeye, so we can use more precise aiming. Well done. Now that wasn't so hard, was it? Follow me. We're gonna try something a little more challenging. Is it killing Mexicans? Please let it be killing Mexicans. The birds around here are always shit. Hell. Scavenging and scaring the life out of the locals. I say we put your newfound skills to the test while doing a public service for the good people of Chuparosa. Here we'll do. I'm gonna scare up some birds. Let's see if you can take down more than one at a time. This is no problem. Can we get onto killing people now? Moral of the story? Don't accidentally let go of R3. Nicely done, sir. You've been taught well. I'd have to say I'm surprised you heard of Landon Ricketts. I would have thought an old goat like me would have been long forgotten by now. I heard many a story when I was a boy. Still do, sometimes. What, these days? I find that hard to believe. What do people say? Oh, you know how them conversations go. Fellers arguing over who's the toughest, who's the fastest, and who shot people in the back. I'd place good money on me still being the fastest. Aye, Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Por favor, Senor! Our back wagon's under attack just outside of town. We need your help again. Whoa, slow down, Ramon. We'll take care of it. Thank you, Senor. Again, you are the savior of this town. Well, my friend, are you ready to take a less theoretical exam? Sure. I don't think I ever rode with no savior before. Let's haul out. Time we put you to work on some bigger prey. Finally. Let's get to it. Are you alright? Just a bit of pain in the knees, damned horse. It's a terrible thing, you know, getting old. One day you catch a glimpse of yourself, and you ain't the same person no more. Your looks have gone, your back hurts, and your pecker isn't working like it's supposed to. See, the problem with old age is, just when you start to understand life, you're too long in the tooth to enjoy it. Look over there. They're in trouble, all right? Come on. Yeah! Oh, I love me a good pixel hunt with bad visibility. Now, Martin, I'll kill you all myself! Slow down! Keep your eyes peeled. These bandits don't give up easy. I can see you haven't lost your touch, Landon. Nobody said I had. You talk real big for a boy who couldn't shoot straight a half hour ago. And you talk big for an old man who can't stand up straight no more. You're a long way from being a Landon Ricketts partner, young, old, or otherwise. He's getting closer. Dios mío, vienen más.
I missed the lantern, but end up killing the dude anyway. All right with me. Better kill those lanterns anyway, just to be safe. Now let's get this wagon back where it belongs. Good book. So much for this quiet life of yours, Mr. Ricketts. I didn't say I'd become a coward. I'm not gonna stand by and watch good people suffer. They've been beaten down for too long. I give them some hope. They don't know how lucky they are. Damn right they don't, my sourcastic little apprentice. Sano y salvo. Nunca podré agradecer lo suficiente. Buy me a whiskey later, and we'll call things about even. Well, it was a short one, but a good one. I'll see you next time when we explore more of Mexico. Thanks for watching.